back to Breakfast Television, everybody. We are live this morning on location at Happy Harbor Comics. Why? Because tomorrow is free comic book day. We're also going to talk about comics, this awesome store. They've got three of them now, as well as maybe Ed the Sock maybe making an appearance. We've also got a wonderful fundraiser happening tomorrow to tell you about tomorrow night you're not going to want to miss. It involves a party and also a great cause. So a win-win situation. Right now, though, to my good friend Rob Hislop in the BT studio. Thank you very much, uh, Bridget. Joining me in the studio right now to my immediate left. Friends, hey. what is Hi. up? We're talking about, hear this stat, Bridge. Yeah. One third of women and 40 percent of men lie about what they, will lie to their partner about the money they spend yes yes <laughs> she goes is what that, is there is there a question there or i just need to affirm that stat yeah just affirm it but the yes the whole big thing is that do you believe in that stat do you think that sometimes a little yes, white lie I do. about spending goes a long way <laughs> Yes, yes, I, I do. do. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I have been known to hide receipts for sure. Absolutely. Um, uh, I am. Um, yes. Um, this is not good to talk on TV, I'm sure. <laughs> you know what? I remember specifically, Bridget, that in one week, you and I both uh, purchased um, a particular sporty jacket from a popular sporting store. And, and I said, oh, I love your new oh, jacket. Yeah. And I bought one too. And we both said. And that Don't we were not tell going to admit anybody. that it was brand new. Yeah. Oh, absolutely. Oh, this is last season. I've had this for a long time. Yeah. That's and why I, are you paying more attention to me? If you yeah. just turn yeah. it right around. I just, what do you mean did I just get this? I've had this for years. You to me in this jacket. I can't believe you don't remember. Yeah, then it's like, you haven't looked at online banking, have you? Yeah. You haven't, well, have you? And the best thing there, of course, is that you know the guys don't remember. Yeah, exactly. It's so exactly. easy. It's so easy. Exactly. Yeah. exactly. So, so guess who is in the house? Ed the Sock. Yes. <laughs> Can you hear the coughing? <laughs> the hangover happening already here oh. on Breakfast Television? Oh my gosh, there he is. Ugh. Look at this. So How can you be so full of energy this early? How, how are you here? So, oh, you have a little hair on your, your bathrobe. Uh, First of all, did you just come from the hotel? Uh, actually, I slept here at the comic store last night because I knew I'd never get up in time. Now, you know that this is a family show. You've been told that you have to sort of, you know, have family-friendly talk. What kind of family is up this early? <laughs> it's unholy. <laughs> Families should still be sleeping. Quite true, quite true. But the kids go to school. I wonder, Ed the Sock, did you go to school? Uh, yeah, I went to school. Uh, how far back do you want to go? What, is this going to be like a biography? Maybe maybe it will be. We're talking maybe. about comics. You want to know if I went to school? Yes, I do. Are those the only books you read? Comic books? Yes. If that's all I read, I would have had a better education. <laughs> so you're going to be here tomorrow, Ed the Sock. Uh, yes, I'm going to be here tomorrow. It's um, at Happy Harbor, and we're giving away free comics now, on free comic book day. Exactly. And this is a rare opportunity. I've actually, I've always, well, I'm a huge fan of your work. Thank huge you. fan. My uh, work, you say it like I'm a painter or something. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> well, well, you could be. I wonder, are you wearing anything underneath that bathrobe? Well, Bridget, we don't know each other long enough to find <laughs> out, but maybe during the commercial break, that would be enough time. Sweet, because I've also brought some friends. I've brought, I, I have some socks from home that I've brought, which I'm sure you're going to love. Yeah, um, no, no. They're non-smokers, but... Yeah, <laughs> yeah, not interested. Okay, great. See, this is how it's going to roll with Ed the Socks this morning, which is awesome. There's a beautiful lady to my left. Yeah, she works with me. She's also very perky and awake this morning. I don't know how she did it. <laughs> cold. And you introduce yourself, because a lot of people right now are going, oh, is it? Well, it's Poison Ivy today. But I'm Red. Hi, from Ed and Red's Night Party. And uh, I'm staying awake, surely, because my wardrobe is completely weather inappropriate. But we're here to talk about free comic book day. So we have some free comics here. Isn't that cool? <laughs> it's totally cool. And you guys are going to be here tomorrow. But let's meet the man of the hour, because this is the man behind Happy Harbor Comics. You are... I'm Jay Bardella. Yay! Yay! Jay! The oh, crowd goes wild. Now, this store is like the little store that could, because I, I'm marveling. <laughs> Pardon the pun marveling at how you've grown so much three stores in the city now and essentially this is this is this the seventh annual free comic book this day? is the seventh annual free comic book day it's a worldwide um, it's supposed to be a celebration of comics the opportunity to kind of introduce people or reintroduce people back into the wonderful wonderful medium of comics it's a it's a fantastic opportunity and we go all out like bringing in big 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 time celebrities like ed and red uh, who will be uh, visiting a couple of our stores they'll be at the downtown location during the uh, morning uh, tomorrow Tomorrow and then in the afternoon they're gonna to go to our north side store people can go by and uh, take pictures and autographs and stuff like that I mean when you
and you got, you know, an icon like Ed, and you've got Canada's biggest fangirl, Leanna Seriously, here. Yeah. yeah, and then everyone will be decked out. There'll be people in costume. We'll be giving away tons of free comics. We've got Woo! local artists doing sketches for free with a donation to the food bank. Um, we're having costume competitions. If you show up in a costume, uh, we're going to take your picture and enter you into a draw for an exclusive uh, one-of-a-kind sketch done by uh, Frank Cho, who's a very, very popular comic book artist, wow. a fan favorite. All sorts of stuff going on. Not to be missed. This is the place to be tomorrow. Uh, we're going to be hanging out here all morning long. As we go to break, though, amusing. Something to start your day. Something to ponder. Amusing by Ed the Sock. Because I know he has your daily thought of the day. Ed? You don't give me any warning? No. I'm supposed to come up with something deep something, on, a, on a moment's notice? Something super deep. Something all right, here, here's something deep. Life. Okay. Um, when you stick your head above the crowd, you get pelted with tomatoes. But there's good money in ketchup. Thank you, Ed the Sock. You're welcome. I'm going to ponder that till 7.50, where we're going to see Ed the Sock again. We're also going to see Red. We're also going to hang out with Jay. We're Happy Harbor Comics. We've got a lot coming at you this morning. Don't go anywhere. Ed is in the house. I don't know. You can go back to bed now, Ed. <laughs> hey,